Before I got into dance, I wrote music. I was studying music composition. And I wanted to write music that would inspire people. There was something about connecting with Mark on the dance floor that brought a whole new level and meaning to movement in a partnership. When I got into dance and choreography and created this company, I wanted to take that idea and tell stories that were bold and people were afraid to talk about and use those stories to inspire change. First of all, we're a team that collaborates really well, so that is a blessing and it makes it a lot of fun because we each we each give a portion of the idea that comes together to make a hopefully more complex and clear story. When we don't agree with something he envisions, we were clearly to say, first off, like, no Mark, that's not gonna work. <laughs> and, and he's open-minded enough to like, you know, take it into consideration and try different, different things to make something work, to make something clear and stand out. A creative process should be a collaboration. And in a show like this, it is, it is a, a huge, huge show. It's really the size of a, of a big Broadway musical. And so there's no one person that could or should do everything. So we as a team decide what needs to happen and then who's best suited to do what. And then I let them do their jobs. And that's what makes this so special because what we're telling is everybody's story. It's not one person's story. And so I think it takes everybody's experience to create that. But we don't just dance for dance sake either. There's always a reason for every little bit of movement. And so the great thing about the show that we're working on is that we get to use music from the 1930s, the 1960s, and the 2000s. So there's a little bit of everything for everybody. You know, it's, it's a really hard business that we're in, but we do really hard things in a really complicated way because we believe really strongly in why we're doing it. Uh, and it's to inspire change. What we're gonna try to portray is a bit of like a, a utopian moment. Like, if, if these people were able to influence society and we were all together, this is what it would look like for a second. Then we're gonna go back into our traffic pattern with our lanes of traffic, very pedestrian. And that is all of you in society saying, great, that's what utopia looks like, I'm not doing that. I'm going back to my ways, I put my hood back on, we go back into traffic.